hello guys welcome to today's video tutorial from ts tech talk so today we are going to be diving in into apps and logs in so most times you you are trying to download an application and it gives you a question to either like their facebook page or um log into their website with um facebook page so uh with facebook account i mean so uh, most times you once you log in into this website it collects your data and although it doesn't use it harmfully it makes use of your data properly in order to decide the kind of person that is downloading this application and whatever um analysis they're trying to keep in so um most times you would want to remove your application from the website you want to remove your login details from the website and from stop them from getting vulnerable so if you if you notice um, most times it appears like something like this like login with facebook and then you go ahead and click on login and then it shows you an application and then you accept so um once it gets to that um this is what the video is all about stuff like this once it says sign up with facebook and then you sign up and accept the particular application and then it signs you up so um mostly um i do not accept that i do not use that anyway but for some reason if you do use it a lot and then it's not bad and if you are done making use of the application just quickly make sure you remove this particular option from your phone from your facebook account so that you will be secure even though the website is hacked so now on this video i'm going to teach you guys how to remove um website um logged in website you already logged in so just make sure you follow this video properly and try to understand if you get confused just leave your comment below and then i'll attend to it so now let's go ahead and open our facebook application to remove some apps which we we do not want to see anymore so now you can notice on the top right hand corner the menu area go ahead and click on it then you scroll down to settings and privacy click on it and then go ahead and select the settings which is the first option next you need to do is to scroll down a little bit to the apps and website go ahead and click on that so once you open it wait for it to load and then you can observe the first option that says logged in with facebook so what that one means it means the apps you've logged in with facebook and if you can notice it says this controls the info the info which is the information you are sharing with a companies with com with other companies through apps and websites you've logged in using facebook so go ahead and click on edit to edit those particular content now you can notice we have like two different active account which i i have logged into and i'm very aware, aware of this because i was the one that did this stuff actually so now if you click on the expire you can notice there is no yet expired um logged in details so they are all currently logged in and i haven't removed anyone yet so all i need to do in order to continue um with this i just I'm just going to go ahead and remove the shared so either way if you want to remove any logged in website or app you can go ahead and click on it or deselect to deselect but if you want to remove just go ahead and click on it and then hit remove then you can notice um if you remove for shared it will delete um your for shared account and activities for shared may also have um infos or your previous logged in so once you've done that you can notice it says um for shares can no longer request your private info about about you on facebook but may still have infos you previously shared so no issue about that just go ahead and click on done because i think um after logging in i do liked most of their pages so that's that and now if you click on the expire there is nothing that is going to be there yet but if you click on the remove you can notice we've removed a particular account and when you click on the view you still notice the details and all you you've shared all the whole data assets they had through and you can notice their data id and whatever it is so there is nothing much harmful about this um, making use of um, these particular features of logged in with Facebook but always make sure in order to keep you secure in order to keep your details secure whenever you are done using the application just make sure you use this particular feature that removes that particular account if you notice very well I only have two but it's because I'm playing this video game and then on the other account I actually downloaded an application which I need to log in first so 
guys just make sure you remove your logged in account whenever it's done and then back out of it and then the option is showed just now to remove the reason why i showed that was because i removed it and that was the last activity that i did before after leaving um the logged in section so that is all for this video for now hopefully you guys enjoyed it and i hope you learned from it please if you do don't forget to share the video with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to the channel to keep the channel alive and please leave your comment below and make sure you give a thumbs up which is like smash the like button and it's very very important so see you guys very soon